someone please help me? There he is, Lloyd. Yeah. I... have not saved it all today. Why is this happening to me? Help. Can't anybody help me? Goddess, please have mercy. Hold it. Look at those teeth. Well, well. Talk about impeccable timing. Please explain how this timing is in any form impeccable. We are with the Crossbell Police Department. We'll distract the monsters for you, so make a run for it. Okay. Y'all are dumb. These tourists are really dumb. Whoa. What's with these monsters? They look seriously tough. They seem to be different from usual monsters inhabiting this area. Do you think these could somehow be monsters from ancient times? Well, either way, we'd better not go easy on them. Think it's about time we give these chumps a lesson in pain. Here they come. Okay. Just attack one. Oh good, it's on fire. You analyze. What are we working with? Okay, it only resists petrify and death blow. It's very weak to water, fire. Okay, realistically, you can use anything you want on it. Uh, an ancient reptile monster. It increases its strength by roaring. Ugh. So we want to focus on water and fire. What do I want to do first? Um, let's use, I think Icicle Hammer is what I want. Uh... Ow. Yes. Um, you go ahead. Wait, what is your new? Craft. Burning heart. Support self. Nulls ailments, gains immense power, but suffers faint afterwards. No. Normal attack this one. Okay. Arts. Let's see, let's see. Aerial. No, it was weak to water. Hydro cannon? Yeah, let's hydro cannon. I'm I'm stealing this uh critical, thank you. Everything's on fire. Oh my gosh, it took like 1,400 damage from being on fire. That's nice. Um, you craft axle rush. These two. Okay, that did like nothing. Uh, you craft holy bullets. This. Okay, this should kill one, yeah. Okay, one down. It's roaring. Hi. Okay, um. I don't want to use a burst, a break yet. Let's do this. And then we'll. Yes. That one's frozen, so it should be a minute before we have to bother with it. Okay, it killed itself. Even better. Uh, you... Attack them that's not on fire? Maybe it'll get on fire. It did not, as it turns out. Ice hammer? 
EP heal is fine. Great. Um, I don't want to push it out of the circle is the thing. Let's see. Let, let's just attack it. It's fine. Okay, yeah, we didn't move it. It's fine. Okay. Okay, there's no square that will hit both, so let's do aerial instead. Ow. Okay, it killed itself. Okay, it's frozen. Uh, do regular Thelus. Okay. Let's just attack. Um, let's use... Ellie's turn to heal everyone, I think, is the play. And for you, Diamond Dust, let's move along. Okay. Just attack it. Tio will probably kill it with this. Yep. Okay, only Randy died. That's not as terrible as it could have been, and we revived him immediately. Ellie learned Strike Bell, and I got four more U materials. It's very nice. Did we defeat them? They look like they're still standing, Lloyd. I don't think we did. That was tougher than I had anticipated. I don't like what we're seeing here. The heck were those things? Still alive, that's what they are. You can't be serious. Are we about to see Arios come to save the day again? Oh no. Can't you guys stay down for one second? I'm way too beat to think about going another round with those things. This is bad, really bad. We need to find a way out of this situation. Ah. Oh, it is Scott and Arios. Thank you. But also, I hate you at the same time. Arios. Looks like I made it just in the nick of time. Oh, hold on just a dang second. What are you even doing here? <laughs> An awfully cold reception, considering I just saved your lives. I was checking the request of the guild when I saw Scott headed down here. I'm aware of how dangerous the area can be, so I thought he might find some help useful. Thank you for saving us, Arios. We appreciate it. To be perfectly honest, we were lucky you arrived. Nah, I ain't buying it. You really expect me to believe you always show up with absolutely perfect timing like that? Don't tell me. You were sitting on the sidelines this whole time, waiting to jump out at the last second, weren't you? I'll leave that to your imagination. Hey, are you guys all right? Oh, Scott, it looks like she finally woke up. Yep, not too long ago. Thank you so much, everyone. Especially you bracers. I don't know how I'll ever be able to repay you. Seriously, we even got to see an awesome show. You took down those insane monsters with one fell swoop. Um, Scott, I really appreciate you looking after me when I fainted. And your skill with that rifle was just... Wait, honey? Uh, well, I'm just glad the two of you are safe. <laughs> History is doomed to repeat itself. Don't fret too hard, Randy. At least we all worked together to save the tourists, right? I would consider this mission accomplished. Huh? Something up, Arius? No, it's nothing. I think we should focus on escorting these two back to our Morica village. 
Watch our six special support section. Understood? You have my thanks for bringing them back safely, everyone. I was almost done for. Don't mention it, Mr. Gaffan. I'm not sure what would have happened if not for Scott and Arios being there, though. Hopefully those tourists take a nice, long nap before doing anything else. On a side note, those bracers are some serious guys. They sure like to stay on top of things, don't they? I can't deny that bracers all seem to have impeccable timing. At least we were able to finish the support request without too many issues. Yes, but one problem remains. During the support request, the guild and the police worked side by side. Now that it is over, how should we go about reporting this? Hmm, good point. What's your call, Lloyd? This definitely wasn't a standard case for us, that's for sure. I said it before, but if Scott and Arios hadn't been there, I'm not sure if we would have been as successful as we were. No, we definitely wouldn't have been, because we would have found the girl. We would have had to split up. Some of us would have had to stay with the girl. Two of us would not have been able to take on those rat reptiles. I think this time we should give them the credit for resolving the request. That won't be necessary. Arios, Scott. Excuse me, Gafan. It seems that your two guests wish to apologize to you. They have reflected on their ways and regret ignoring your warning about the ancient battlefield. Oh, is that so? They don't really need to be so repentant for my sake, but hopefully this was a good lesson for them. Excuse me, Scott, what did you mean by that won't be necessary? Well, I've talked it over with Arios and we came to a decision. We want the SSS to be the ones to say they completed the request. Um, did I hear you right? Looking back on the case, you two clearly did the heavier lifting. That's not true. Since you all were able to go on ahead, that brought, that bought me time to look after the lady. And if you hadn't made it to the man in time, I'm not sure if he would have made it. Sure, our results may sound nice on paper, but in the grand scheme of things, we think the SSS was crucial to the request's success. Feels sort of embarrassing to be praised by your rivals, don't you think? I wouldn't say we're rivals in the slightest. In fact, it appears as if you've all matured a bit since we first crossed paths, special support section. Especially you, Lloyd. What? Do you remember when we first met in the Geofront? Oh, you mean when he tried to, like, kamikaze it? Back then, you decided to recklessly throw away your life fighting against an unbeatable foe. As if you were some kind of martyr. But this time, you refrained from doing that. Despite your odds being slim, you kept searching for a way to break through the situation. One requires unwavering strength to relentlessly go against all odds. Such strength is far more powerful than sacrificing your own life. Though your ability can't be denied, it's the fact that you were able to find another way when all hope seemed lost that proves you've grown. Thank you. It seems I've talked too much. Scott, return to Crossbell City and report to the guild. Roger, Arios. Well, special sports section, it was a pleasure. I hope we get the chance to work together again someday. Likewise. I would be lying if I said I expected to hear encouragement from Arios McLean of all people. Tio, don't be rude. But you're right, it was a little peculiar. I wouldn't let it bother you. We finished the support request, didn't we? That's enough to be happy about. I certainly second that. Special support section, thank you once again. I'll be knocking if I need help again. You can always rely on us, sir. We'll be waiting at the door. Okay, we have finished. Missing tourists. Those idiots. I can fish with a new rod. Heart. I'm gonna need to find more carp. Okay, nothing's biting. 
Actually, can I go upstairs and talk to those idiot tourists? You're not the tourists. So, his name is Scott. Hmm. Wait, are those hearts I see in your eyes? Oh, you guys. I forgot to mention it before, but I wanted to thank you all for saving us. If you hadn't shown up, I'd be... Ugh. Yeah, consider not being dumb in the future and heeding other people's warnings. Might as well talk to the... Mayor or whatever. Chief. This year's anniversary festival brought in many more tourists than usual. Derek's plan was a success, but still I can't say I agree with his goal. Was this all connected to his desire to modernize the village? Well... Maybe he just wants the village to, you know, not die. I think that's a valid thought. Um, let's go to the fork in the road. I want to see if I can get any new fish at that fishing spot. What am I at? Three hours? Okay. Where am I? Oh, it's the thing I need. Yes. <gasps> this was worth it. Shining Palm drops you material. A dastardly shining fluff. Insanely quick and, well, insane. Near impossible to hit. I hit it. Oh, it ran away. I hit it again. It gave me a U material. Yay. Because it's the only thing it can drop. Wow, that little punk gives a lot of seppeth. <gasps> and the tomato. Joyous day. Okay. Really? Really? How do, how do I keep missing? What is happening? It ran away. These must be like rare enemies or something. They're definitely little weirdos. Thank you for the tomatoes. Okay. Is the rest stop up here? Maybe it's not. Am I remembering wrong? I think I am remembering wrong. So I guess if I ever see those puffballs, I should definitely kill them. Because they give you materials. Okay, well we can try fishing with the new rod here. Carp, sure. You gonna give me anything? Oh. Okay, it got away. I'm gonna need to get more carp from somewhere. Okay, I got it. Ah, oh, it was catfish. I don't need that. Okay. 
So I wonder if um, at the ocean spot I can fish with the viper head. I don't want to try. I also need to go kill more of those um, bats because I didn't get any of the great dumplings or whatever. Well, actually, ain't it already past noon? Dang. Looks like we didn't make it back in time for the parade. A shame. I had heard rumors of Mishy riding in a car. Yeah, searching the ancient battlefield ended up being a lot tougher than I anticipated. Let's head back to the SSS and take a much needed break. Yeah, let's. But actually, no, because I have things to do. Hi. Check my rank. Wow, managed to somehow catch even more rare buttes, I see. Amazing job, Lloyd. Starting today, you are now a first class fisher. Phenomenal work as always, Lloyd. I received first class fisher certificate. You've finally reached the rank of first class fisher. Man, you work quick. Think I made it to that rank five or six years ago. And that was the final push needed to convince me to start up this branch in Crossbell. I remember clearly the tears of joy that filled Mr. Fisher's eyes when I proposed my plan. Well, never mind that, Lloyd. I might as well tell you one more thing while you're here. As a first class Fisher, you now have the ability to purchase the deluxe dumplings here at the Fisherman's Guild. I don't have to go kill those bats, I can just buy them. This is an all purpose, high quality bait developed by yours truly. All kinds of different fish will bite it. Oh, huh. I don't think I've heard of that kind before. With it, I'm sure I'll be able to get even more kinds of fish. I might even be able to try out some different fishing techniques while I'm at it. <laughs> you never let me down, Lloyd. You're exactly right. Change your bait at the usual fishing holes and it's like you're in a whole new world. Ugh, I can't forget. I need to tell you the requirement to advance to the next rank. Next up will be the rank known as Master Fisher. You'll need to catch 23 unique kinds of fish to rise to this rank. This one's going to push you beyond your limits, but I know that if anyone out there can do it, it'll be you, Lloyd. Okay, bye. Oh, it's so cheap. Bro. If I had 9900 Mira, I would do this. You know what? I can make that happen. Hold on. I'll buy for you in a second. 